<laughs> Laughing intro. <laughs> Alright, that was my wild mage run for the day. <laughs> let's, uh, let's do the illusionist. I truly hate that. I like, there's not too many characters I can sit there and be like, man, this guy sucks. That guy truly sucks. I like Crossmancer. Outlaw? Yeah, that seems fun. What's the best way here? Yeah, like this. Let's try to go like a uh, damagey illusionist, I guess. Decrease cast time for all these guys. No, um, it does trigger when the fiend. I didn't move. I also didn't want to go to the middle. Um, we might just restart this real quick. The uh, we win this. All right, yeah. It does trigger for the fiend. Which is the main reason why fiend warlock is like the combo you can never not put together. Okay, so we got we got lots of items we want we want for this guy. I mean, we got frozen shell. <laughs> okay, we got your talisman. Guess we're halfway there. We got all the frost items we need. I think we'll end up um, putting the frozen shell on the illusionist. Warlock, what the heck? Yeah, give me that. This seems fun. Warlock strives to have everyone dead but him. So having him be the second tank like really puts a damper on that mood. And I don't think he regens enough with one or two for it to be worth it. You'd probably make it viable, but it would be, it wouldn't be as, it, it'd be viable, I think. You could probably make it work. We're, we're having some morale issues. We'll, uh, we'll just take the, the free morale. Probably dump this. For safety. No, it doesn't. Um, each character can only proc at once. I didn't get another, uh, Surprisingly, Frostmancer, pretty good tank. <laughs> okay, guess we're, guess we're looking for an avalanche now. <laughs> Jesus. How much damage does this give? 20? Jeez. Guess we're going Frostmancer DPS? Let's take the money. Yeah, let's take the money. Truly didn't expect the way this would go. <laughs> it's, I think Warlord's Borden is like easily one of my favorite items. All right, he, he died, but like. We could do this, but we literally just did a Pharaoh's Mark run yesterday. And we, I could take this and win the game, but I don't want to. It's, it's not the most exciting. I think if it was my own time, I would have taken that to win.
Because it's so early to get Pharaoh's Mark. What are you doing here, Pharaoh's Mark? <laughs> Get out of here. Trying to be cheeky. Crystalline. We do like Esoteric, but Crystalline would uh, will keep us alive. I do miss old Frozen Shell. It's not nearly as good anymore. But it's still pretty good. It's not a bad item to pick up. I mean, we're just, we're here to have fun. What, what boss are we facing? Is this, who is this? Pick up another crystal one. I think we'll probably grab, grab Cleric next and bring Illusionist to the front. <coughs> what bosses? Why am I figuring what bosses? Normally it's big, big boy at the top. Is this... Oh, it's the, 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 the drain HP person. So we can't even use Warlords here. Honestly, let me upgrade Brain Sage. We, we might be able to use Warlords with Brain Sage upgraded. Of course we get poppers. We murdered the dogs. <laughs> oh, so much damage. <laughs> A sentence I truly don't say too often, but <laughs> for, for multiple reasons. I mean, I believe we'll preempt this here. Yeah, upgrade Brain Sage was the choice. Oh yeah, we're definitely getting the Cleric here. <laughs> Everyone says that. <laughs> if I knew League any better, I'd understand the reference. That's all I was able to pick out. Was it from? Was it was somebody from League? Are there any other ancients I'm really looking for here? Cup seven seven of cups. Oops, where'd I go? Middle? Okay. The first two fights, we should be fine. It kinda does look like this guy. Free stats. I don't really care too much about this item, but it's upgraded with stats. Just don't do it. Hey, he didn't do it. We should be good. <laughs> Yo, Frostmancer hurts. 
with every upgrade or with all these Tundra Talismans. Uh, I don't know why I went this way. I'm so used to just clicking the middle. That's such a bad habit. <laughs> Hopefully we murder all of these guys with the first cast. That's a sizable amount of damage. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, whenever I take the cleric, they give me all the items I need to make the DPS cleric. <laughs> Yo, this is something else. We're going to take uh, Warlords off because uh, cause I don't want him stealing that. Yeah. And uh, we hope. Let's just stun him again. Take this. I mean, truthfully, like, let's just go. <laughs> we hear the burst the enemy before they burst us. This is this team cop. It's a rarity. Crag Cleaver. One day, I swear I'll actually use you instead of just talking about using you. Oh my goodness. It's so much damage. <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll skip this to keep, uh, I felt like I was getting this. I truly thought I might get, <laughs> might get the tormented, or the the ring, because at this rate, it's pretty crazy how how lucky this run has been. I mean, to be honest, do I even want Avalanche? <laughs> Hello, Crack Cleaver. Do I even want Avalanche? We kind of, we kind of scale linearly with how much frost we have in an enemy. Okay, let's sell. We'll have two upgrades here. Uh, we'll keep the, the mana ring. Ah, yeah, we went. Solid. This seems good. This seems good. Is that boss here? This is good. 
Yeah, it does remove all attacks. That's why I think, like, to be honest, we don't even need it. We'll get, we do get stacks pretty quickly, but. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> what is this? This is so cool. I'm slightly worried about this fight. But I guess we'll just kill him so quickly. Like, who cares? Yeah, he doomed that guy. <laughs> I don't want any of these. I don't care for any of these. All right, we have, we can still fill a tank here actually. I think we'll, uh, We'll, so we'll get Paladin. Is anyone else fill? The final boss is actually a bit of a worry. Yeah, I think this is our best bet. Right, and we can swap some of these items around. Like that there. This on you. Yeah, let's get we have the Saints Val Illusionist. I think it's a, a good choice because he'll save us a little bit. We have double potions. We'll gain. We'll gain two potion slots. Now we just hope we outburst these guys. And also get Interstellar. <laughs> Interstellar would be so cool. Because we could actually see like the full potential of this build. I mean we're kind of seeing it already. But we could see more full potential. Sure. Ooh. The only troublesome fight. Never mind. <laughs> Who, uh, who's worried about healing when you just one shot everything? Get out of here. No way. No, that's a horrible choice. We're going down here because we got double potions. Don't kill yourself, Frost Mage. Someone actually died. What is this nonsense? <laughs> I would have, but it, it directly impacts life giving. Sure. 
Sure, let's do Fenrir. So I didn't want to get rid of max HP. All right, last shop, we're going to buy all the potions. So the way this combo works is life giving chamber deals 50% of your max HP, but all other heroes gain 75% max HP and a healing over time for the next 10 seconds. On top of that, we have maiden's mirror, which directly affects this healing over time, which in turn triggers the clerics uh smite ability which every time he heals a hero by any means <laughs> he gets it so it just keeps ticking or he deals damage so it's four heals on top of his brain sage going off a little lost merchant i truly did not want to see you but we will buy these potions since we have Seven of Cups. I think I take this? Get rid of that. I was thinking illusionist. Oh, there's frosting. Uh, we want this. We want both these. I just want these potions. <laughs> I'm thinking. I have two thoughts. Either we we put it here, so frostmancer doesn't take damage. And then we don't have to worry about healing the cleric. We'll, we'll, we'll put this for now. Actually, can I sell? I, I didn't know how much. I couldn't remember how much potions cost. It's also like <laughs> Yeah, I think that's the choice. Um Let's get pocket sand specifically for this fight. It didn't even it didn't even proc. We did so much damage at proc too quickly. Here comes the second stun. No, we have cleric. What even? It doesn't even matter. <laughs> I've never had so many frost amulets. Aww. I really thought that was interstellar. All right, normally this fight's a pain in the butt, but I think we'll be 100% fine. As long as we get our first cast off. Yeah, the, the big effect is the uh, We've, we've got the illusionist going, so we're good. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking specifically for the tanking. Like, that's pretty good. We'll, uh, we'll get the shield. Alright, we're gonna have to move here. Go like this. And then these two guys will split damage down here. 
Because this guy will hit, but won't do any damage. We will probably... We'll definitely pop this stun potion. Yeah, let's pop this stun potion. It's six seconds. <laughs> also, these guys are dead. <laughs> Another... Uh, they just got freed. Nice. So, ah, it's so nice destroying the tentacles. <laughs> They're the biggest nuisance in the world. So I'm hoping for this final fight, we don't really have a lot of burst damage. Like, we have an initial bit of burst damage, but then it falls down. So I'm hoping for this final fight, the boss saves us. <laughs> it doesn't take our best debuffs, our best buffs. Uh, but this will be fun. That was a pretty hefty poison. And also we have an 80 mana bomb. Double potions, amazing for the final fight. All right, we lost all of our buffs <laughs> and Outlaw got smacked, but that, that was to be expected. The cleric, cleric is killing with uh, all this healing and cleansing. Nice. That was a good win. Honestly, the coolest set of builds I've done in a while. I mean, not the cleric. This is just a normal cleric build. But the Frostmancer? Seeing him smack with his AoE in the burst? It's pretty, pretty good, I'd say. Hmm. Honestly... I think I'm going to end it there. Normally we stream a bit longer, but it's Monday and I'm tired. Um, so we're going to end it on a good note, which was that run. So as always, hey, thanks for hanging out. It's fun. <laughs> Chat was going crazy today, so that was really exciting. It was a lot of fun talking about all the various roguelikes we all like. Um, but I will see y'all tomorrow. I hope you have a good night. As always, like, subscribe, comment, blah, 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 blah. I hear it every day. <laughs> see have a good night everyone thanks for watching and i'll see y'all next time